The U.S. Army has awarded a five-year contract worth $488.7 million to the Ordnance and Tactical Systems Division of General Dynamics and the Florida-based subsidiary of the Norwegian defense firm NAMO. This contract is for the production of specialized red bag propellant charges designed specifically for howitzers equipped with M185 and M199 cannons. The M198 howitzer, an American 155mm artillery piece introduced in 1979, requires an 11-person crew for optimal operation. It is equipped with the M199 cannon, which has a barrel length of 39 calibers and can launch projectiles weighing up to 44 kilograms. The M198 howitzer has versatile firing capabilities, reaching up to 22 kilometers with standard projectiles, 30 kilometers with rocket-assisted projectiles, and up to 39 kilometers when using the M982 Excalibur projectile. In terms of firing rate, the howitzer can achieve a maximum of 4 rounds per minute and maintain a sustained rate of 2 rounds per minute. The cannon provides excellent flexibility in terms of elevation and rotation, with an elevation range of minus 5 to plus 72 degrees and a traverse range of 45 degrees. The M198 howitzer weighs approximately 7.17 tons in combat configuration and measures 11 meters in length and 8.53 meters in width. It is generally towed by a 6x6 truck and can reach road towing speeds of 72 km per hour and cross-country towing speeds of 8 km per hour, notably, it can be rapidly deployed and displaced, taking approximately 6 minutes to set up and around 5 minutes to relocate. On the other hand, the M185 is a 155mm cannon tube used in various versions of the American self-propelled howitzer, the M109. The tube is 6.7 meters long and can fire shells with a maximum range of 30 kilometers. It is designed to withstand high pressures and extreme temperatures, ensuring its durability and reliability. The M109, in service since the 1960s, is a widely used artillery system globally and has undergone multiple modernizations to adapt to changing battlefield requirements. Recent variants like the M109A6 Paladin and the M109A7 PIM offer significant improvements in mobility, protection, and firepower, enhancing its effectiveness in modern operations. This contract will be active until September 6, 2028. Given the ongoing conflict in Ukraine, the United States has depleted its ammunition reserves and needs to replenish them. Hence, it's not surprising to see substantial contracts like this one for this type of ammunition.